The Academy of the Hebrew Language fought against the Hebrew word for backing and backup for decades, only to admit defeat. I'm Elon Gilad, I write about Hebrew and Jewish history. Let's dive into the story of Gibui. So Gibui was coined by General Chaim Laskov, head of the Air Force in 1950, based on the Hebrew word for back, gav, as a loan translation of English's backing. It was modeled after nouns like nisui, experiment, and shinui, change, and was quickly adopted by the general public. But then the linguists at the newly founded Academy of the Hebrew Language caught wind of the new word and strenuously objected to it. Why? Two reasons. One, they objected to the influx of loan translations from English, which they claimed was overtaking the language. And two, the word was incorrectly der derived. You see, Nisui and Shinui were fine because they were derived from roots ending with a Yod, and this was the regular noun pattern for those. But Gibui's root was Gavav, and therefore required a different noun pattern, which would have resulted in Givuv, just like the root Savav yielded Sivuv. Instead of Gibui, the Academy pushed its president, Naftali Tu Sinai's suggestion, Tibuchin, but of course no one lessened. In fact, the use of Gibui expanded and began being used for backup as well. In the end, this second use was approved by the Academy in 1992, and in 2003 the Academy finally conceded defeat and approved Gibui for use as backing. Now you know.